Yes, uh, thank you, Chair. Um, I was wondering, the previous topic here was about the, the Eurozone crisis and setting up the stability mechanism. We have a rescue fund, and I was just wondering uh, if maybe we shouldn't give a tax discount to LGBT people. Because you see, they are 5 to 10 percent of the European population. They contribute to our economy, they contribute to the rescue fund, to bailing out uh, countries in the Eurozone, and yet they do not get the same rights as other EU citizens. They do not get the same protection and services from their governments, so maybe we shouldn't ask them to pay the same. But I'm, I'm being a bit ironical, colleagues, because of course that is not the solution. The solution is that we start as a European Union and its member states to give the same protection and the same rights to all EU citizens. It is time that the European Union uh, delivers. And I'm actually very glad and proud to be a member of this House which has really become a champion of LGBT rights. And I very much welcome the first ever resolution dedicated to homophobia. And Mr. Buzutil, I very much welcome the support and the cooperation of the EPP group because I think the cross-party support for this resolution sends a very strong signal to our own country governments, but also to those governments of the countries mentioned, Russia, Moldova, um, uh, which was the, the, the other one. Well, there are plenty of countries that treat LGBT, LGBT people very badly. Um, and I think a final point, uh, colleagues, here is about um, the hate speech uh, of opinion leaders, political leaders, religious leaders that is not innocent, that is not innocuous. It contributes to a climate of hatred, intolerance and violence. And the final thing I would like to say also to Mr. Buzutil, discrimination is not necessarily less bad than homophobia because if we tolerate discrimination, unequal treatment, we send a signal that some people are less equal than we are and that justifies homophobia. So colleagues, I ask everybody to wholeheartedly endorse the resolution tomorrow. Thank you.